a helicopter wasn't the only thing buzzing at the National Sports Center. The atmosphere was buzzing too after an entertaining 2-2 tie between AC St. Louis and the NSC Minnesota Stars. Over 2,000 fans were treated to a good game that started out with Minnesota having the better of possession for the first 20 minutes. However, AC St. Louis started to take over and had the better possession for the next 10 minutes. From there, the first half evened out a bit. Brian Savilkas had a good opportunity in the 34th minute for the NSC Minnesota Stars and a ball from Johnny Menyonger, but couldn't put it away. In the 43rd minute, AC St. Louis went up 1-0 on a very good finish by Jeff Cosgriff off a nice, low-driven cross from Mark Bloom. Now, the fans were probably feeling that the first half would end with the St. Louis up 1-0, but in stoppage time, Troy Cole was called for a handball in the box, and the Stars were awarded a penalty kick. Captain Johnny Manyonger would step up to take the shot from the spot, but he was denied by Alec Dufty, thus keeping a clean sheet through the first 45. The first eight minutes of the second half were played in an even tempo. The best chance to that point came in the 53rd minute for the Stars Melvin Tarley on a nice ball over the top from Kentaro Takata. Minnesota started to put on some pressure from there. However, they continued to come up empty due to the strong defensive play by Jack Trainer and Troy Cole and the goalkeeping of Alec Dufty. AC St. Louis started to put on some good attack, and in the 65th minute, Chris Salvagioni put AC St. Louis up 2-0. They continued putting on pressure, including a shot by Luke Kremelmeyer that would ding off the left post. The next 10-15 minutes would kind of even out again from there. In the 79th minute, Simone Bracalello had a wonderful opportunity to get the stars on the board, but his header would just sail over the bar. That was the start of a heavy attack put on the stars, and finally, in the 87th minute, Brian Savilicus found the back of the net and cut AC St. Louis's lead in half. The stars continued their attack after the goal, and four minutes of stoppage time was added to the second half, and that's all the stars Jason Mora needed to slot the ball past Alec Dufty for the tying goal. A short time later, the final whistle blew, and we would have our final score of 2-2. Two to two. Next up for the NSC Minnesota Stars is the Puerto Rico Islanders on Wednesday, July 21st, 7 p.m. kickoff here at the National Sports Center in Blaine.